everybody wants to be a beast. Everybody wants to be number one. Everybody wants to be the best. Everybody wants to succeed. Everybody wants to have to be and do what they feel they've been called to do. The challenge becomes that most of us, when it's time to do what beasts do, we don't do it. So Ichi, what do you mean? Look, I told you, I wake up at three o'clock in the morning. I just woke up recently and it was 2.45. And the average person in me said, E.T., just pull the covers back over here. It's okay. You got 15 minutes. But the phenomenal in me said, E.T., if you go back to sleep for those 15 minutes, there's no guarantee you're going to get up at 3 o'clock. If you go back to sleep right now, you might wake up and it's 4 o'clock. You might wake up and it's 5 o'clock. You might wake up and it's 6 o'clock. All you have is right now. Are those 15 minutes that sweet? that you're gonna push back your dream, that you're gonna push back your goal. Everything you've ever wanted, son, you're right there. You're so close. You're closer than you've ever been before. Those 15 minutes are not worth the rest of your life. Those 15 minutes are not worth you slipping down the chart. That is not worth it because you wake up at 3.30, some other kid's getting up at three and he's got 30 minutes on you today. So I need you not only to want to be a beast, I need you to get in beast mode and stay in beast mode. I need you to put on beast mode. I need you to live in beast mode. Everybody's got a dream. Everybody's got a goal. Everybody wants something in life. But many of you in this room right now, your beast mode is idle. Your beast mode is not turned on. And when you leave this place, I'm telling you, your life is going to go to a whole nother level if you can learn to turn that switch on and keep that switch on. When you want to become a diamond, your whole attitude change, your whole mindset, your thinking, your relationships, the decisions that you make, how you spend your time, your energy, all of it changes. See, this is something that you can't be in this business. This business has to be in you. Continue to work, continue that course, believing in the worthy cause, the end state of it all, knowing that the pressures and the problems coming are welcoming. Those are the situations that are going to formulate and mold you into the person you want to be. Accept this as the reality. Sacrifice this day for the investment in the future. Greatness. So I'm telling you in life, you start running from a class, you start running from a subject that you don't like, it will haunt you for the rest of your natural life. It ain't going nowhere. You gotta take that thing out, like, you gotta take the breath out. So some of y'all are afraid of math. Go after it. Go get it. Don't run from it no more. Go get it. You go in there and go get that grade. You go in there and get that information so you can pass that class. You gotta go get it. I want you to go in confidence that you've never had before. And every giant in your life, slay him. You go back and slay him. Don't kill him, slay him. I'm tired of people talking about, I want to be successful. I'm tired of people saying, I want to be great. Look, everybody wants to be a beast until it's time to do what real beasts do. And let me tell you something, that means getting up early, going to bed late. That means you don't go to sleep when you're tired, you go when you're done. So remember, success is never on discount and greatness ain't never on sale. I challenge you to have more. I challenge you to do more. I challenge you to be more. You gotta get this beast mode. You gotta embody beast mode. Everything about you has to say, I ain't playing. If it's to have, I'm gonna get it. And I ain't leaving none of it behind. It's mine. Beast mode. With success in life comes more haters. To all of the men and the women who work their ass off every fucking day. Don't lose no sleep over these haters, man. The reason they got a problem with your life is because they don't have a life. The reason why they paying so much attention to all of the amazing and wonderful things you got going on with your life and your career is because they don't have one. Never, ever allow anybody to make you feel bad about being so blessed when you've worked your ass off to get it. You decided all the clubs, partying, hanging out, popping bottles with models, 